what happened on the pit six? Yeah, um, oh, I was just sorry. working backside in the. Sorry. It's okay. Uh, just working <laughs> backside on the concept we were running, and um, you know, just stared it down, and the guy made a good play. So just you know, playing bad ball, you're gonna you're gonna pay for it. Overall, how did you kind of grade your performance here tonight? Yeah, it was up and down. Um, I did definitely did some good things, converted on that fourth down, a couple third downs, but um, missed some throws and missed some reads too. And then obviously the, the pick six kind of lingers in your mind. So um, like any game up and down, a lot to improve. It seemed like you found a good rhythm on the touchdown drive before that. What, what, what went right on that? Is that from the yeah, I thought our guys did a great job working hard. Obviously we've had some long drives. I think that was a 14 play drive or something like that. And so um, that's what it takes. It takes converting on third down and, um, you know, we. Kind of in general, his offense got got behind the sticks a little bit, and so um, we're trying to make up for that. And um, just proud of our guys for, for playing hard. To have a drive like that, and then kind of have your last throw be the pick. How tough yeah. is that, just from a competitor standpoint? Yeah, it sucks. Uh, it, it sucks to throw interceptions in general, but yeah, to be to the to be the last play is, is definitely tough. So that, like I said, that one will linger, but um, it's football. You know, you're gonna learn from it, move on, and um, I'm not gonna make that mistake again. Hey, now, how much more comfortable do you feel underneath Luke Getz's offense this year? Yeah, Luke's done a great job. Um, he really did a great job in OTAs and then in the camp. And now since we started preseason games of just um, hearing us out, you know, wanting to know what we like, what we don't like. Um, it, it is really an awesome open dialogue between him. And he's very open to what he's thinking and wants to know what we're thinking. So uh, I definitely enjoy time with Luke. Hey, did, uh, did, does it feel like, you know, with every play under a microscope because it's a quarterback competition, did that – make it tougher to let the interception go and process your way through it and everything? Yeah, I think, um, you know, interceptions, like I said, are tough in general. And so, um, look, it's it's a big play, but it is one play. And so, um, like AP said, just try not to ride the emotional roller coasters up the up and down in the NFL and try to stay um, my same self every day. And, and that's what I'm going to do. Coach Pierce mentioned that he hoped to be able to make a decision on the quarterback position after uh, this game here. Uh, how do you feel about just the whole body of work up to this point? Yeah, you, yeah. Um, you know, again, I, I keep saying it's on like a broken record, but there's good plays and bad plays. There's plays I want back, and uh, there's plays that are well executed. And I think um, just trying to string together good days, trying to string together and practice good periods, good sets of plays is the most important thing. And you can't really look far too far back, too far ahead. Um, Got to focus on the task at hand. And so um, just trying to do that every day, and um, it is what it is. Thoughts on uh, Trey Tucker? Seems like he keeps taking steps forward. Had a big game tonight. What yeah. do you think of Trey tonight? Yeah, he's he's a beast. He works so hard, takes care of his body, um, studies really hard, and obviously we, we came in as rookies together, so I saw a spot in my heart for him. But he's it's super fun to watch him. He's obviously a dynamic player, and he's he's really growing his um, skill set uh, this offseason he did and into the season. So it's been really fun to watch him. Thanks, Thanks guys. Appreciate it.